A well-being economy is an economy which puts the well-being of people and the planet first. The economy is a means to an end, not an end in and of itself. It's an economy that creates wealth, prosperity for human beings, societies and the planet. By well-being I'm thinking about both physical and mental health, the chance to participate in society and, and to flourish. So a very holistic view of well-being and I believe that's what our economies should be for. So well-being suggests an improvement, suggests a better life, suggests a change in the way we are with others, with our economy, with nature. For me, a well-being economy is one where the world is just and it values the people and it values nature where there's equality and where we also care about our habitats, our home, our earth. The key thing is, is getting all this amazing work together because it exists. People are demonstrating whether it's small projects or amazing progressive businesses or policy makers who are going against the grain of GDP growth. People are there saying and showing us this is what a well-being economy looks like. We see it as a unique moment where we can meet with others and maybe create, a, we hope, a global movement for an economy of well-being that's based on, on fairness and, and real health. It's really important that people who are kind of standing on the streets and making a practical change hands-on are being part of larger coalitions who try to work on different levels. It's a whole system. Um, and it has to be tackled as a whole system. And I believe that we all is trying to do that. The Post Growth Institute is so excited to be part of We All because it's a chance for us to connect with others committed to a vision of a future that works for everyone within ecological limits. We're at a crisis point in humanity um, with the environment, with inequality, with people's standard of living. If you're heart sinks when you can't afford housing or if, um, hmm, if, if you really want to understand what is it that we're doing to our planet, then uh, this is a movement that is most vital.